Ah, oh, fuck. 179. Oh, you kidding? Hello and welcome to Marito Solo Leveling with a Woo! And yes, everyone, we are now halfway point of the season, and hopefully, this is where the real fun kicks in now. Oh my god, guys, I am so excited. Man. I am so fucking excited now because last episode pretty much at the mark now that well Sung Woo, well, he is indeed a change man now. My god, god, just thinking about that last scene. Well, should I say the fight scene from last episode? was enough to tell me that this is where we could witness some peak solo leveling well obviously there's still more to go for our boy Jin Woo because he still needs to you know level up and stuff like that but he, he just cannot stop leveling up man he just, eventually we'll get to see him reach the point where he just can become super OP and so oh my god guys I wish we get to witness that in this season man because you know it's only 12 episodes this season so I don't really think we can get far into the story but I'm pretty sure we can end the season with a very interesting cliffhanger maybe we just, I just taking a smart guess right now but yeah guys i'm just like, really 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 excited for more from Jin Woo, man because the last episode pretty much showed the fact that he is indeed able to kill hunters now well obviously the system wants him to kill the hunters but he has no hesitation man he's going for it he's the, basically this is a survival of the fittest now so whoever goes against him he was just gonna eliminate them and that is the mindset that i like from last episode so guys this is where we're going to witness some peak solo leveling. And I just cannot wait for today's episode to see where, what's the next level up for you, man. So with that, let's get started with today's episode. I didn't want to watch more solo leveling already, man. So with that, let's get started. Yeah, I mean, obviously, the case of the previous episode really started to suspect a lot of these, you know, policemen, what might be happening. I mean, it's kind of nice to see if we have some more sibling bonding time because I, I don't know what I was saying this, but the sister's kind of cute though. Yeah, it was easy. That because of his leveling system, he can easily deal with anything at this point now. So yeah, it's quite easy for him. Yeah, just focus on getting strong, protect your family. Don't have to think too much about what happened. Oh, oh, seems like he's not able to get drunk. Well, seems like he couldn't get drunk by drinking because his system's protecting him from alcoholic poisoning. <laughs> Unbelievable. This is so bad for those who want to get drunk, man. Because, you know, the system is healing you every time. So in other words, his whole body is, you know, immune to bad substances and he's able to regenerate quickly. Oh, he's back for more already? Okay, that's interesting. Oh, that's cute. You know, this is just worried. <laughs> but, you know, the fact that he has re leveled up now, he has become more stingy, I would say, in this case. So, I do wonder what he won now. Oh, let's form a team now, since we both have a dirty little secret to keep for each other. Hmm. Yeah, it seems like he's not listening anymore regarding to more raiding. <laughs> well, here we go, man. The money talk. Oh, so because of what Jin Woo did last episode. Oh, let's just do a lot more guild rating up to like 20 so that we can form our own guild. Wow, he has some strong ambition there. So you're saying that he wants to form his own guild because his family wants to form his own guild that he's not really on board with it. He wants to have his own guild where he can be with Sung Woo Jin Woo then. Huh, interesting. Dude, you're, at, you're expecting too much from Jin Woo, man. Dude, this guy, after one raid, he's enough to like convince that, you know, he can help him achieve what he wants. Oh, what is it? Money talks, like, uh, like what I said? Well, to be honest, though, the more he participates in raiding and stuff, he can level up more. So this is a win-win anyway. So he might as well just join his, well, so-called raiding mission. Hmm, you might as well not, you know, try to pester him too much, man. He's already thinking about too much about his leveling up mm -hmm. so that's the little brother of the guy that trying to you know backstab them <laughs> uh, oh, oh boy he is starting to suspect those two are involved in his brother's death already you know this is about to go down hard oh ho, ho. yep 
Guys, a big bad boss is here. Another round against them. Let's go, baby. Oh, whoa. Sister joined the brother's training arc. Okay, I would love to see some you know, sister and brother bond. Yeah, I think he's starting to start thinking more about uh, you know, the money situation now. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> hey, you can keep up with me now. Keep up with your own pace. Oh, so he can actually go beyond the the limit. <laughs> hey, I love it. Oh, she finally caught up. <laughs> no, this is what happens when you try to train with a level upper. You have a new reward. Okay, full recovery. Holy cow, damn. This is some um, fucked up ability, man. Some quick recovery, seriously. Oh, another secret dungeon for him to level up. Oh my god, let's go, let's go, baby. Elixir of life. Okay, guess there's a reason for him to like complete this dungeon quest so that he can use it for his mother, of course. See? So, another epic dungeon adventure. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Oh, this looks even harder too. Oh, damn. That door looks really bad, really badass. Oh, she said like a level up, you know, the level of dungeon if he had to conquer. So, a very hellish place for him to fight this time. Well, let's just see what he can do. Of course, he got the escape gem too, just in case something bad happens. Oh shit, starting off strong already, a Serapis. Ho ho, boy! This is some level up monster you have to defeat this time. Well, time for more Jinwu level up greatness, everyone. Okay, seems like the monster is going to be a lot harder this one in this dungeon. Oh, there we go, the eyes. Yeah, let's go, murderers in 10. Oh, never mind, seems like they can backfire it. Oh, whoo, well... Paralysis? Does it work though? Oh, guess not. Okay, seems like the monsters in this one is a lot harder than any of the one. Yeah, definitely. Is, uh, I think it's an S rank dungeon. Oh shit! Oh, oh, Woo. oh shit! Is a yeah, definitely a lot harder. Oh, fuck off! Oh my god, bro! Oh, oh my yo! Dude, he's already halfway through his life point now. Dude, careful, you. Oh my god, seems like this is not gonna be easy for him, man. Well, I mean, he's holding on quite nicely, but dude, look at this fight. If he defeats that thing, he's definitely leveling up a lot already, but seems like it's not going well. Okay, he's uh, losing a lot more blood than expected. Oh! Oh my god, he's been thrown around, man. Oh, oh okay. Camouflage Sen. Well, he cannot be messing around anymore because he's literally under the, the 1000 life point now. So, yep. Escape or try to go again. Okay, never mind. Oh, fuck. Well, there goes your chance of escaping. Okay, seems like he's able to regain a couple of health points from the elixirs. Okay, okay, that's more. Oh, okay, drinking the poison and see what you can do. Hmm, oh shit, wait, oh shit, no way. Hey, well, another round. Oh, oh shit. Oh god, more health loss. Oh, wait, what? Oh shit, it worked. Hey, hey, that's a good sign. Now hurry. Now's your chance. Oh, ho, 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 wow. Dude, come on, Jimmy, let's go. Oh my god, he's now bouncing back hard, man. Yo, he's holding on so nicely. Oh shit, now what? Ah, oh, fuck. 179. Are you kidding me now? Hey, wow. No, no, back it down, man. Don't back down, Jinwu. Come on, keep fighting it. Yes, come on, keep stabbing it. Apply the poison at it. Oh, 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 oh those eyes, man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit.
Oh, wow. Persistency pays off in the end, man. Oh, my God. Now, that has to be one of the hardest bossy fights yet. So, finally, he leveled up even more now. So, guess he's able to gain some high status from that victory. Elixir of life. Hey, hey. Well, I, did, I guess you had to find three items to form it. So you had to find three extremely rare items to form the Elixir of Life. Hmm, hmm. Yeah, that's a spirit. Well, on to the next wherever gate you had to go to now to get the Elixir of Life. Oh my god. I gotta say, that has to be one of the more life-threatening boss fights that Jimmy will have for a while now. And definitely can see the fact that persistency pays off, man. Like, at, literally, he willing to go that far to the level up. He willing to sacrifice a lot of blood loss. So, oh, ho, ho, wow. Jimmy, man, this new change in mentality really benefiting him, man. If this was the Jimmy back in episode 1 or 2, he will already start struggling want to run away. But, well, he was tempting to, but, you know, got, got, the stone got knocked off his hand, so he had no choice but to fight back. So, you, like I said, from the past couple episodes, Jinwoo change of mentality is really helping him, like, really level up now. And you can see the persistency of him stabbing the Cerberus, like, so constantly. It's just like, oh my god, that is fucking peak. So, gotta say, man, that, I think that always, that's, boss fight is also like another turning point for Jinwoo now he able to defeat it now he gained some new items and level up points so I assume that you know from this point onwards he's gonna fight stronger enemies and able to defeat them so the next one is some sort of demon castle he has to go to now so oh my god I have to sorry about this guys I have a bad feeling so, well, what can I say man definitely looking forward to next week because I feel like the next one he's gonna go to is it's gonna be a lot more difficult than the Cerberus one, but I'm pretty sure you know the Cerberus ones are already enough to give him tell him that that more the, the gate he goes up to, the more level up he gets to you know to achieve higher status in church in order to get to those items that can help get the elixir of life. He needs to defeat bosses like this, and he had to like really step up. And I can't wait to see what he's gonna do next next week because I feel like the next one he gonna fight gonna be even harder than the one we saw in this episode. Well, other than that though, yeah, sister's getting very stuck up about Lee Chan now, so you want to train alongside with him. And you, you can see the fact that sister is starting to see him differently in this case too. Like, you say that his brother is changing, which I don't blame her for seeing that way. And of course, last episode, that Knight in Shining Armor wants to work with him more so that he can get 20 Ray to form his own guild, which Jinwoo said, Nah, I'd rather work alone. I'm solo after all. So, I mean, I don't blame him for saying doing going for that approach, but I don't know. Sometimes it's best to have someone accompanying you, someone helping you out. Maybe, you know, maybe he will have, he will have a change of heart after this, well, gate that he's going through right now. So, yeah, definitely looking forward to next week to see what's next for him. But, of course, I'm pretty sure you won't back down from this sort of offer of, you know, what he's willing to contribute to helping him form a guild. Other than that, well, obviously they're in danger now with the little brother of the one he killed from last episode. But other, than, but pretty much, you know, Jimu can deal with him anyways. So yeah, ne looking forward to next week, which I'll be doing the reaction in Perth because you can say I'll be on holiday next week. But hopefully, you guys still look forward to my reaction. With that, smash the button. I'll see you guys then.